gang and I air it out. We slime and I bang it up. We banging a wind up. It's red and we pour it up. My diamonds they glowing up. She wet and she wanna fuck. Be patient, I'm counting up. Alright, what is up, guys? Our review stuff back here once again. Been a long time since I've done a review, but we're gonna get right into these Travis Scott Air Force Ones. If you guys are new to the channel and you like what you see or into UA stuff, let me know. Comment section down below. Let me know you're rocking with me. Subscribe. Drop a like on the video if you're a fan of mine or a whatever viewer of mine. I don't really take myself as someone that has fans. Um, I just hook you guys up with what you see. I don't condone any of it. Just showing you guys what I buy so you can see for yourself what you would be getting if you ordered from any of these websites. So, these took uh, about a week to get here, give or take. Um, also, before I get into them, make sure you hit that uh, follow button on my Instagram. Link is in the description of the video. Um, if I stutter here and there, it's just because I haven't done a video in like two weeks or so. So I'm kind of trying to get back in the groove of things. But I digress. Um, yeah, so follow the Instagram. Link will be in the description. Also, um, another thing is the shipping on these shoes like i was saying is about a week give or take week or two um and they should be at your house that's how fast they got to me with uh ems to canada so pretty fast shipping in that um these are from shoe out so you always get qc pictures before they ship as well so if you see any imperfections let them know prior to shipping and yeah i think that's pretty much it so um not you know ramble on too much longer let's get into the shoes themselves i don't know what this is oh my god i think it's my girlfriend's lash glue or something <laughs> um anyways so this is all this uh information right here website whatsapp wechat instagram interviews rv stuff you can save 20 dollars on any purchase so there's all the information right there put that to the side real quick um and yeah actually me let me have a real quick talk uh chills kicks my boy tony over at chills kicks he mentioned to a bunch of us like review youtubers that kind of makes sense um and a couple sellers i think he got on board with it um what would you guys think about doing these reviews on igtv as well as youtube um but if I did do that, or if we did do that, we would obviously not include the information in the description that we already do right now. Um, <clears throat> but instead, obviously have more information on Instagram in the same video for you guys. Just it would lessen the chance of us getting our channels taken down. And then if we ever did, we would still have that following on Instagram regardless. So let me know your guys thoughts on it is in the comment section down below. So it would just be full videos on IGTV. So that's another reason make sure you follow the instagram link will be in the description let me know your guys thoughts on that just thought i'd point it out um i mean i don't know if i'm getting shut down anytime soon i'm at 1.5k subscribers as of making this video so we'll see but yeah it is what it is so this is the box you get with these um air force one you know it says it's just a regular like special air force box that the other travis ones came in the moma air force one off whites and the mca off white air force one so nothing you guys haven't seen before these i don't know when they're gonna release i believe sometime in november if i remember reading correctly um and i think travis gave a pen a pair to a fan early at the at a concert of his or something like that i don't really remember so got the air force one low travis scott size 12 rice white dark blue brown made in vietnam 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 whatever um let me know if there's any Thing wrong like i said these aren't like fully released so obviously there might be some imperfections on the box so it, i mean we've yet to see any reviews on them i've checked on youtube and i haven't seen any um the only thing that i've seen i think is like a video of 2j's kicks talking about them but that's it i haven't seen any actual reviews on them or nothing so i think i may be the first um obviously it is a ua shoe so we'll see but this is the paper it comes with, so you can see it is kind of different. It says Air Force One, Air Force One, Cactus Shack, pink paper, um, just like we've seen in the Travis Scott One Lows. 
and the highs just minus the Jumpman logo, but instead replaced with the Air Force One logo. So we'll see if that's what the paper looks like when the uh, retail card comes out. Nothing else in the box, um, but if it's not what it looks like when they come out, I don't really give a fuck because I'm not wearing the box on my feet, right? So it is what it is. So here's the shoes in all their glory. Pretty dope kicks. Um, the first few pictures that I've seen of these, I actually didn't know they were a Travis collab, um, but I kind of had a feeling for some reason because I saw records and stuff like in the, um, I don't know what this is. I think it's like just denim. It kind of feels like denim, honestly, but I don't know. Um, and I seen like records and C and stuff. So I kind of felt like it was Cactus Shack. Uh, but yeah, I'm honestly, I don't know. They, they just don't strike me as a Cactus Shack shoe. So we'll see when they come out. Uh, what everyone's saying about these but here they are first early look at them uh, pretty dope shoe there's a whole lot going on for sure for sure I'm sure you guys know the you, you can see right off the bat this big ass thing on the tongue with the zipper but there's just a quick little overview of the shoe it says TX on this one and then I think on the other one it says M something right MC. So if you guys know what that stands for, let me know. If it's something super simple, I'm gonna feel like an idiot, but I can't think of anything to be honest. So, a whole lot of different materials used on these shoes, as you guys can see. So, we got some suede. Um, this is more like new buck ish. Um, <clears throat> then, of course, you just got like print and stuff like that. So, there's like a quick little overview. This kind of feels like some denim. Or something it's a loose thread over here I'm gonna have to deal with after and just cut it off or something um, no big deal though of course stitching otherwise seems to be on point I think there's a little bit of blemish like with just the stitching it's not straight right there but not a whole big issue I mean this is I believe the first batch of these that come out so flaws are to be expected otherwise it looks good so this is a YKK zipper, which is always a good sign. Got some corduroy over here in that like, I don't really even know what that color is, like maroonish and brown or in uh, black as well. Then this swoosh is camo. Again, it's kind of like that canvas material on that. So here it says, see like, uh, I don't know what it would say, man. That's the thing, like how we struggled to choose. So none of this, none of this comes off with scratching. Good sign, of course. Uh, so here you see the yellow panel. You do see the Cactus Shack logo. So that's kind of what confirms to Travis collab. Uh, yeah. So you guys can see. Got the regular gum bottom on these, just like the other. Travis Air Force ones that have been released, the sales and then the whites as well. Both have the gum bottom. Um, you got some mint stitching all across the midsole. On the inside, got kind of like that uh, plaid Burberry sort of print with Nike Air. This thing, I don't really know what, what purpose it serves, but it's just there, um, it splits open, then you can see the laces. You can take it off if you don't want to wear it, but Kind of just adds like a unique like touch to shoe. Travis is kind of all about stuff like that. But this, to me, serves no purpose. Whereas on his other um, stuff like the uh, Travis Scott Sixes has a little pocket that serves a purpose for holding stuff. Right, this. I don't know what purpose it serves besides like maybe protecting your laces. But then you get this thing dirty, so I don't really know. Um. Yeah. I don't know if there's a whole lot more to talk about. There's just a general overview of these. Quality looks good. Um, besides the little stitching blemish I pointed out, and the little loose thread, but that comes with most shoes. Um, even like retail pairs sometimes, so. But yeah, this is what the tongue looks like. Totally forgot to mention that. It's like plaid. Got Nike Air Force One. So, laces are these 
wear those like kind of maroon color laces. I'm not a huge fan of that color. It does come with a blue pair as well that matches this. So you guys can decide what laces you want to put on. At the end of the day, they're probably going to be covered by this big ass thing on that, on the part of the shoe. So <laughs> um, I don't know if the, the laces really matter all that much. Just the inside of this one does have a size tag as well. So you can see there. There's all that. Got some stuff underneath the tongue, just regular like branding, like swoosh branding. Besides that, not much more to cover, man. Travis, Air Force Ones, um, quite the deviation from his first pair. Obviously with the Velcro swooshes and stuff, this kind of just is all over the place. Pretty cool just to see some of his creativity being used. Um, of course, this uh, you can also like undo and kind of have it just hanging if you if you want to wear them like that. So I mean, again, what I don't know what purpose this serves, but it's there. It's just a little detail. So quality feels good. There you go. So that's the back of the shoe. Forgot to mention that it's made out of wool, and then you got the neck Air swoosh, the Nike Air embroidered in there as well. So whole lot of different colors on this shoe let me know you guys thoughts in the comment section down below of course hot not i don't really know what to say it's a travis shoe i'm a long time fan of his just not playing the outrageous prices these are going to go for once they drop in limited numbers of course as everyone knows so you know i'm gonna wear them i don't know how much i'm gonna wear them but i'm probably gonna wear them pretty heavy uh, for at least like a week or two until <laughs> as with me another shoe pair another pair of shoes comes in that I like more I'm gonna wear those but with these I'm rocking pretty heavy with right now um, and it's kind of just like you don't really have to match a whole lot these can kind of be the centerpiece of your outfit I feel just because of how strong the design is and all the elements on the shoe so let me know your thoughts on in the comment section down below guys if you're new to your channel you know what to do with all that being said I'm gonna leave you guys with that have a blessed day, stay safe, and I'm going to talk to y'all in the next video. Peace.